What's going on, people? You're tuned in to myself, George, from The Soul Supplier, and we are here in the city of Berlin to give you your first ever store guide. We're going to take you through the best stores, but we've only got 10 hours to do it. So we're going to see how many we can get through. Let's go get it. Okay, so the first store that I'm standing outside of is Vu Store. Now, this is a concept space, and when you step inside this store, you're going to be in for a luxurious experience. Let's take a look inside. What I like most about this store is you've got a mix of contemporary items with the street style as well. So take a look here and you've got down to your classic Ben Peaks and your Nike products. It's quite mixed up here. Let's take a look at the footwear. Nike Stone Island, Sock Dog, and a range of products, some from Acne, the Nike Alvis, Soft Darts, the 95s, the new Apta, some Mayflies here as well. The footwear selection is quite minimal, but it's definitely hand-picked. Where Vu Store really comes out on top is with the amazing selection of fashion brands. You've got brands like Acne, Gosha, Carvin. So let's take a quick look at the menswear. I've picked this out here. This is a serious jacket from Ami. So Ami, Alexandre Matusi. Then you've got stuff like this here, Tresbian. Our Legacy as well, oversized shirts. You've got stuff from Acne as well. The menswear selection is definitely on point in here. So you need to check it out if you're in Berlin. Okay. So the next store outside, and it's one kilometer from Vu store, is Overkill. I'm sure you've seen this before. I'm excited to go into this one. It's a big store. They've got clothing, trainers. They've even got graffiti cans on offer. Let's take a look inside. You can smell the paint as soon as you walk in. Take a look at this. Let me just take you through. So you've got filling pieces here. You've got a good selection, Lacoste. You've even got Kahu in here. Reebok Insta Pumps. Asics. How can we forget the Kendrick Reeboks? Look, it just goes so hard. This is crazy. Adidas. The shelves are so high. You can't even see all the selection. This is the Nike wall here. This is crazy. Lunar Force flying it. Lunar Force duck boots. New sock darts here. Mayflies. Mercurial R9s. Prestos. Even got the Air Force animal pack that just came out. This is where things get really interesting because the clothing selection in here is insane. Literally a rainbow spectrum of, of Stone Island. You've got all of the new Stone Island stuff as well, like this hand corrosion collection that released. You've got the tapered cargo pants. You've got just the David TC washed stuff with, some of this stuff's crazy. If you like Stone Island, get into this store in Berlin. Again, more Adidas, Penfield Parkers. We've got some Alpha Industries NASA jackets, look. There's a strong selection of Alpha Industries in here. And then you walk into this last section here. Nike Tech. How, how could you not have Nike Tech? A strong selection. Look at this, look. This is crazy, look. This is, this is probably one of the best Nike tech collections I've seen from an independent store, even in London. Maybe even beats like Nike London for some of the different bits they've got. For me, Overkill's footwear selection, you're probably not gonna beat it in Berlin. And their streetwear, I think they aim to be the best streetwear store, or one of them. So if you need streetwear or footwear 
and it's sportswear related, then you need to get here to Overkill. If you're coming to Berlin, you need to visit hhv.de, as the website is called, and this is the home of vinyl, streetwear, and sneakers. So you know you've got the vinyl and the records in there, it's where it all started, so take a look. So as we know, how connected music is with streetwear culture, and this, as soon as you walk in on the right, represents that. And then straight away in front of you, after you've looked at the records, you've got, again, high shelves with, well, a range here. So we got the new EQTs that just launched here. No EQT uh, 9317 stuff. Adidas Hamburgs. Air Max Zero selection. Flying it Air Max Ones. Those brand new Spiridons as well. Personal favourite of mine. An ASIC selection here. Again, the Kendrick, Kendrick Reeboks too. This is a whole section dedicated to Carhartt. So, if you're in Berlin looking for that, this is the place for you. This is pretty cool as well, so if they haven't got what you want or you just want to look on the website and browse through, you can use these, you can use these electronic pickup stands and find what you want. So we've got uh, some brand new Patagonia stuff here. Nice colours for the summer. North Face, Alpha Industries as well at the back. And women's, women's too. So Alpha Industries, Bombers, Nike and Adidas too. It's real nice. And there's some more trainers that we forgot. Okay, so for me, I'm going to judge this on how many things I'd buy. So already I've seen a Patagonia jacket, a Naparigi jacket, a Woodwood top, a Mo Money Mo Problems t-shirt, and a Bent Peak hat over there. So I've seen like five things that I'll definitely buy. So this for me, streetwear wise, is killing the game, all right? The trainer selection in here isn't, say, as good as some of the other stores, but it's, you've still got a wide range, but maybe not as many exclusives. But the streetwear, they picked well. So you need to visit here for the streetwear 100%. Now we're outside Firmament, Berlin. This, this shop, from taking a look on the outside, it's like, it's so fresh, the way they've designed this. Um, it's a bit smaller than your overkills or your HHVs, but from what I've seen, there's some good stuff in here. Let's take a look. So one of the main things that caught my eye were the Firmament parkers here on the left. And then you've got the sneaker wall here some New Balance, some Visvim as well. Take a look, the Visvim. Stone Island boots right here. One thing that a lot of you have been talking about is the Vans Undercover collection. You saw the sticker on the window, it's right here. You've got the grey, and you've got the burgundy. You can't forget those, in stock as well. Another store where the Stone Island selection is on point. The new hand corrosion collection here. And this crazy shadow project, Parker. Look at this. This is a, this is a favorite of mine. Probably gonna get this one. Um, and then you've got Porter bags, Stone Island bags as well. Some really like, some unique t-shirts as well with the Firmament branding on them. How can we miss Alpha Industries again? It seems like Alpha Industries have really made their way into Berlin because they've been in every store. And how can we forget this guy in the middle? This is just adding to the whole feel of this store. I personally, I like this store, I like to shop in here. Uh, the selection is minimal compared to some of the others. But if you like your stony and you like some of your more unique pieces from WTAPS and also some unique firmament t-shirts, then this place is for you. 
Originally started in Copenhagen, Woodward sells a range of clothing and trainers. In here, they've got Comme des Garçons, Mason Kitsune, as well as their own brand, Woodward, but we're really interested in the trainers. Let's take a look inside their other store. Very minimal store. The first thing I'm gonna tell you about, we've got both Stone Island sock darts available. Both are in stock. The black, which is sold out, and the green. You take a look up there, you've got the tri-color. It's a new balance. These are very, very popular. I know that these are a favorite right now. Insta pumps. It's very minimal in here. I like the way this is laid out. It's very easy to find things. Look what we have. GPX Air Max TN. These are a favorite of mine. They're a bit crazy, but they're nice. Even got the Kif Aspen Pack, the Response Trail. That's pretty impressive. Some Woodward hats, don't forget them. And this Woodward bag as well. This might have to be a cop. There you have it. I'm standing outside Civilist in Berlin. This is where the skateboarding culture started at this store. You're gonna see that it's very skateboarding focused with Nike SB and some Adidas EQT Palace. They stock Palace too, so if you like Palace, it's okay, so straight away at the back, you'll see the skateboards on the wall staying true to that culture. And then we'll take a little step down here. You've got a small selection of trainers, but what I really want to point your attention to is Civilist's own brand. I mean, there's so many things that I'd buy in this shop right now from their own brand. This jumper is fire. You know this color's fire as well. This is a nice color. And there's just so many different nice t-shirts from Civilis' own brand. You know, that it is stocked in other stores, but this is one of the only places that you can get a lot of this stuff from Civilis. Then you've got some of the last Palace bits here, including the Palace EQT, which, as we know, is still in stock at a lot of places. There you have it. Okay, so the next store, and a personal favorite of mine, is Kix. I've worked with these guys for a long time. They've got a sick selection. Let's go and take a look inside. So what you're gonna notice straight away is how fresh this store is. I mean, the sign outside was supreme. It's, it's sick. Look how fresh this store looks. So, you've got various rails dotted around. Some Nike SB over there. Um, I wanna draw your attention to this brand as well. This is Park Authority. This has got some crazy bits, like, look at this. This is nice, man. As with all stores in Berlin, Alpha Industries have made their way in. Look at this. So I'm, I'm seeing a common theme in Berlin, which is high, high ceilings and lots of trainers stuck high. So look. You've got the Air Max CBs, Jordan 6s. A very, very strong Nike selection here. As is big right now, the EQT, as you can see here. Some really nice women's, the Sun Glow NMDs, the black and gold NMDs, and the Cortez, which we know right now are massive in the UK, it's been up and coming for women. I mean, the way this is laid out, for me, it makes it very easy to see all of the trainers on selection, and there's definitely some good clothing in here that I haven't seen anywhere else. Ones like this, pieces like this. Yeah, the kick selection is definitely strong right here. So for me, for unique items, this is the place. So I'm standing outside Paul's Boutique, which is vintage streetwear. And I'm not allowed to go inside and film, but I wanted to show you this store here as well. Right next to Paul's Boutique, you've got number 74. And the trainer selection in this shop is probably the best that I've seen in Berlin so far. You've had the Colette collab for Adidas, the recent one, the sneaker exchange one. You've got three Ultra Boost 3.0s, the Navy, the White, and the Burgundy. Why three boosts? You had it all in here, undefeated collab. So I'm not allowed to film inside, 
So you're going to have to come and see this one for yourself. But number 74 for trainers, it's a, it's a key one to look at when you're in Berlin. You've all seen SNS in London. Well, I'm standing outside Sneakers and Stuff Berlin, and I've got to tell you, this is a brand new store. It opened in December, and the trainer selection is insane. Let's take a look inside this crazy store. So, as soon as you walk in, on the right hand side, you've got your dedicated Adidas section. Look at this selection right here Uncaged Ultra Boost, 3.0 Triple Whites. Oh shit. Look at the uncaged selection. These, the Pure Boost ADO Day Ones. These are my favorites. King Push EQT in Berlin, still available. NMD R1 Winter Wall, still available. White Mountaineer in City Sock, still here. End Collab, NMD C1, still here. Look at this. This is crazy. Here we've got the dedicated Nike section. Black and white, blackouts, some foam posits over here. We've got a solid range of BBC as well. Make sure you check this. Don't worry. For the man them out there that like the rowdy stuff, you got this. Over here. You got various brands. You got Under Armour, Puma, some real nice Asics too. The original Kendrick collab. Here it is. Yes. And I'll show you one final thing. This is the dedicated women's section. Jordan Four Royalties, right here. Cements as well. Top three. Top three! Sneakers and stuff in Berlin is crazy. This store is insane. The clothing selection, they stick to their brands. Nike, Adidas, BBC. This is the trainer, the shop for trainers, all right? For sneakers and stuff, as they put it. But sneakers is their focus. So make sure you visit sneakers and stuff if you need a great pair of crepes. I'm now standing outside Soto's store. Berlin. And the great thing about this is it's right next door to number 74 and Paul's Boutique with sneakers and stuff being around the corner. So if you visit Berlin, make sure you hit up the center here. Number 74, Soto store and sneakers and stuff. They're all within about literally 100 feet of each other. It's perfect. Let's go inside. The first thing that you're going to notice is this trainer wall here. Nike Focus. Stone Island Sock Darts. Up tempo haze pack, loop and X. The Nike selection is strong in here. I can tell that they picked out some of the best. And also these recent Air Forces, which for me, I like this colorway. It's a bit of a mad color, but this is nice. Take a step through here into the clothing. Tell this store, it's got a really nice, comfortable, it's like a very homely feel. It makes you feel right at home when you step in here. Here's some nice stuff from Norse Projects. I personally like this bomber. I was looking at this. And you've also got some, uh, some beanies from Norse Projects, as well as Mason Kitsune. As we know, Mason Kitsune doesn't come cheap. They've definitely got some unique items in here. He's been blowing up. Keep seeing these everywhere. Some more Nike at the back. Funny enough, no Adidas in here. It's not a problem, because they've got some other good bits. As we can see in here, the selection is minimal. This is a boutique store, but you're very lucky because it's amongst some other great stores too. So you can come here and you can also check out some others. There you have it, Soto store. The final stop of the day is Soulbox. Now this store is a little bit further away from the likes of number 74 and sneakers and stuff, but take a look at this, because it's definitely worth a visit. I'm inside Soulbox now, as you can see, it's very white, very lit up. You've got an upstairs section and a downstairs section. Let's take a look at what they've got. So straight away, favorite of mine, the Spiridon Ultra. You can't go wrong with these. 
good Jordan selection, a brand new Royalty Edition. Ultra Boost 3.0, triple white. And the brand new Addy Zero, Olive Cargo. Old box, pretty box. Uh, so, a lot of you right now are hyping on Adidas. They're killing the game at the minute, so I'm gonna tell you. Soulbox, as well as sneakers and stuff, have probably the best Adidas selection in the whole of Berlin. So if you want Adidas, if you want NMDs, if you want Ultra Boosts, they've even got some of the Yeezy Boosts downstairs. If you want those, make sure you visit Soulbox. So, basically, this is an industrial robot. Okay. And uh, it's a bit of a glimpse into the future where maybe someday there's a 24-hour sneaker store where you just go press the go to the vending machine, yeah. press a button for your size and the model you yeah. desire and uh, the robot will bring it to you and then you can get it out here. Nice. So maybe so one day people like us will be useless. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, so the day is over. We've gone to over 10 different stores in Berlin and I've managed to cop so much that I've got a whole Alpha Industries bag full of stuff. I've copped sweats, I've copped a new APC wallet. Literally, Berlin is full of heat. I wouldn't even go as far to say there's more heaty stuff in like a confined location than London. This shop, this place is sick to shop, honestly. Some of the highlights for me for trainers are definitely Soulbox, sneakers and stuff, and number 74. So if you want crepes, make sure you go to those stores. Soulbox is a little bit further out, but sneakers and stuff is nice and close to number 74, Paul's Boutique, and some of the other places. For clothing, I think my personal favorites, Firmament had a good selection of custom garms, like stuff I haven't seen before. Um, for other, other clothing, Overkill. Overkill absolutely killed the game for clothing. This is the Berlin Store Guide. Let us know which city you want to hit up next time. I'm Jules from The Soul Supplier, and if you want to find out what I got in this bag, make sure you watch the behind the scenes footage. See you soon.